Facet syndrome is a very common spinal condition, and what it involves is pain of the joints between each one of the vertebrae in the spine. We see it in the neck, the mid-back, and the low back. And the facet is basically a joint between each one of the vertebrae. The vertebrae stack on top of each other, just like blocks. And between them is a joint to allow the normal mechanics of the spine, or a small lever, so that the joint can twist and bend forward and backwards. Injuries often occur from a slip and fall, or an overuse, such as running, where the joint is overworked and a lot of pounding motion up and down. Or it can happen, too, from a degenerative process where arthritis develops inside the joint and the joint breaks down much like rust on a bolt. When that occurs, it affects the normal motion and it reduces and the muscles around it work much harder and often get very tense and tight trying to protect that area that's injured. We'll put patients in physical therapy to improve strength, mobility, and range of motion, but sometimes that's not sufficient. MRIs can help confirm the diagnosis when we see a degenerative process or malalignment to the vertebra. Sometimes we do x-rays to see that there is actual shifting of the joint itself, which is beyond the normal amount of motion that we would expect in the joint. When that happens, we'll often put a small amount of cortisone inside the joint to reduce inflammation or to confirm that that's the location where it comes from, and that may be enough. But when that doesn't suffice, we'll go in and block the small nerve to it. And think of that like rebooting a computer. And putting medicine in the joint is like putting oil on a rusty bolt. When that doesn't help to reduce the pain enough or improve the function of the patient to the level that they want, then we may go in and actually put sugar in the joint or do prolotherapy to help stimulate the joint to get stronger and improve the normal strength and mobility of the joint. Platelets can also be used, the platelets from your blood to help stimulate the immune system and we concentrate those to about five and ten times the normal level that would occur in your body and we inject the ligaments that hold the joints together, the facet joints, whether that be the neck or the back, to stimulate the ligament to be stronger and return more normal function and reduce pain and return people to their level of activity that they desire.